America is the land we love. Who among us has not gotten chills hearing the star-spangled banner, or fought back tears singing God Bless America? Visit the Statue of Liberty or the Lincoln Memorial, and you'll treasure the American dream. Watch the changing of the guard at the Tomb of the Unknowns, or wave the flag at a Fourth of July parade, and you'll feel pride in the American spirit. Return from a trip abroad and hear a customs officer say, Welcome home, and you'll be grateful to be a citizen of the USA. This sense of American uniqueness has been evident throughout our history. Tradition says that the song Yankee Doodle was originally written to mock the ragtag colonists who couldn't possibly compare to the great British Army. But in true American fashion, those hardy souls took the song and made it their own. Once independence was won, a vast, unsettled continent stretched westward, and Americans refused to huddle on the eastern shores. The unknown beckoned, and once again rugged individualists with not much more than dreams set off to make them come true. When gold was discovered in the mid-1800s in California, the rush was on, bringing wealth for some, hardship for others, and adventure for all. In a cavern, in a canyon, excavating for a mine, dwelt a miner, 49er, and his daughter, Clementine. America survived the great tragic division of a civil war and came out better and stronger. As more and more states were added to the Union, Americans were eager to cultivate the fertile farmlands of the Midwest and ranch the great plains of the West. So they plowed and planted, they roped and branded, they raised crops and cattle and families from the coast of Maine to Golden California and from sunny Florida to the Pacific Northwest. This country has always been filled with people who dared to believe they could make dreams come true with God's help and with their own hard work and initiative. Americans have invented everything from the telephone and the telegraph to vaccines and videotape, from the Ferris wheel and the floppy disk to blue jeans and the bulldog, from the microwave and monopoly to the tea bag and the teddy bear. Whether Americans are on an assembly line or in an office, at a school or a hospital, or wherever the labor of America takes place. We're willing to work hard, we're ready to play hard, and we're used to dreaming big. It's just the way we do things here in the USA. How do you make a 
typical American. What is it that makes us unique? Well, you start with boldness and a sense of adventure. Add an attitude that looks at hardship as just another obstacle to overcome. Throw in a dash of the ability to laugh at ourselves and an unshakable belief that dreams can and do come true. Shape it with faith in God, love for family, a desire to achieve greatness, a willingness to work hard, and courage in the face of danger. Oh, and finally, don't forget to season liberally with patriotism and good old-fashioned flag-waving pride. That's what makes America who we are.